Yo, what's up, guys? It's Thunderboy359, and... You can score a hero. And we are just doing, like, you know, kind of a commentary video. Like a podcast? About, like, stuff. Yeah, like that one Ustream we did, like... Uh-huh, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, what do you have to talk about? Well, you just talked about. All right. I don't really no, have anything. To... I don't have anything to talk about. I'm trying to think of something to talk about. Let's talk about um the most annoying person in our class. I think we already talked. Yeah, I know, but let's talk about a different person. Who else is annoying? Gail's really mean, ignorant, selfish, and annoying. Uh, that's ex. She's ignorant, selfish. Hypocrite. That's me. Ah. <laughs> My chair keeps making this little click sound when I turn it around. The loading screen? Oh. It's not even Halloween anymore! Happy Halloween on November 15th! <laughs> it's 11 p.m. right now when we're doing this. No, it's like somebody called the shopping, giving with the costume on. Uh, Happy Halloween, people! Happy Halloween! Happy Halloween! Oh! I Actually, I have thought of something to talk about. I looked this up earlier today because I was thinking about some sort of haunted house. Because Jesus reminded me, because you were talking about, like, Halloween. Is that yeah. there was this haunted house that opened in 2004 and closed in 2010. And about 2006, they introduced, um, like, a little shirt reward. So the shirt said... No, the place is called, like, Pharaoh's Eye or something, like, Dragon's Eye. It was, like, called, like, the Dragon's Eye Haunted Barn. And so, you get a shirt called, that said, with a little skull on it, it said, I peed my pants at the Dragon's Eye Haunted Barn. And you take a picture with the shirt in your hand that shows you with the pants that you pissed in. At the horn fair. <laughs> it's the silliest thing. I can go right now and show you a picture of that, but we're podcasting. Okay. You have to piss your pants to get a shirt. <laughs> but there were reports in 2008. There were reports in 2008 and 9 that people were just drinking a lot of like of liquids before they came in. And they were purposely doing it, and they kind of. I just remember when I gave you the black of piss bag. And my, my. The yellow wool, <laughs> yeah. Yes. We have a yellow wool, we were passing it around, calling it the black of piss. It looks piss color on my desk. Okay, Luke. Yes. Yeah. Okay, what's the heroes? What could you be? What are you best at? Warrior. Okay. The if you're... warriors look gay, though. <laughs> they... <laughs> they look gay. They know. <laughs> oh, you can get different outfits. Different clothes. Huh? I'm a nerf, but do I deserve the whole thing? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Great. Great work. I don't know. Woo! Oh boy. Name Thunderbolt Three Five Nine. Yeah. All right, I'll do that after the podcast.
I can't believe there is a haunted barn that gave you awards for peas in your pants. I know. I can't go online. Search it up. It was like I p I don't know what the actual place was called. I don't remember. But near the end of the podcast, I'll just go and look it up. Cause I don't remember. Well, maybe after the podcast, I'll look it up and show you. Uh. Okay, I'll get it after the podcast. It's boss. Okay, cool. Good to know. In a way. Did I continue? Did I actually complete my story on that barn, or did I not? Wait, yeah, I did. I was. No. The last thing I talked about was that, like, the 2008 and 2009, there were reports that people were just like ch- taking a lot of swigs before swigs, as in t- drinking a uh, beverage before they went into the barn. And uh, what are you reading? I don't know. I don't know what you're reading. All right, let's continue with the podcast. Uh, I just said let's continue with the podcast. What should we talk about? Pope. Pope. You're not part of the podcast. Oh, remember, I was playing Track Mania earlier today, and I'm gonna upload the video, but there was no voice. No, no, you okay? I was. We were playing Track Mania, and then was it Mikey or was it you? I think Mikey said. Mikey said, "What's the capital of crap?" And John said, "Piz," but then I said, "Turd." And we all just started laughing. What is the capital of crap? A turd. It's a turd. No travel. Claim reward. So who are you? I'm kind of worthy from that. Mm-hmm. Who are you? I'm a person who went to a haunted barn and got a reward. For pissing your pants. Yeah! I think my human water fa- faucet is breaking. I think we should call the kid a plumbing service. Call diapers. Get water. Get water. <laughs> oh, that's something we should talk about right there. Since we we're on the topic of the board, let's just talk about peeing pants. Let's just talk about peeing pants in general. It's gonna be the Pee Pants Podcast. At least he doesn't have any pants to pee in. No. He's not even gonna pick up on the podcast because it's. <laughs> so we don't have to see it. I honestly think. Yeah, no. No, no, no. Um, like I was saying earlier, we should continue with the topic of just peeing pants. That's just gonna be the topic. Okay, stop singing. Alright, now... Fine. I want to continue with the podcast. Alright, where did we leave off? Oh, yeah. We left off with me saying... No, what me say, John? 
How many times do you remember besides that part where you're like, Hey teacher, I'm leaking. <laughs> How many other times do you remember? How many other times do you remember? Anything else? Alright, name one that you remember the most. Besides the teacher, I'm leaking one. I used to do that when I was just getting used to not wearing, like, diapers. That's what I used to do. Like, I was looking around, I was walking around, and I would just... I was just walk around. When I was, like, five and just getting used to, like, wearing underwear, I would just go over into the corner and just stand there and wait until I can't hold it anymore. That's what I used to do. Was was pre K really the most you remember of peeing your pants? I think no. Oh shut up. Is that the most you remember of peeing your pants in pre K? Is there any other time? Just no, no. Okay. Just making sure. Yeah, there's a nothing, there's something to learn to teach her how to handle a kid who's freaking pissing his pants. Remember you do this? What are you doing while doing the podcast? It's just a repeated GIF image of the podcast. Why? <laughs> because I'm bored and there's nothing else to show. So we're just gonna have a repeated GIF from regular show. Yeah. I got a banana man background in Yeah. Cool. We got two minutes left in the video. We got two minutes left in the video. Let's think of something. Um. Let's crap on. Okay. Oh! Oh! I just got like the best topic ever. When I was in fourth grade in like 2013, we had a kid in it. We were just getting. We were just talking about like having extra pairs of pants in the back room. And. And one day, like, we're in math class, it's like 11, 10 a.m., and we're in math class, and all of a sudden, the kid, like, three rows behind me shouts, I had an accident! And then he says, but it was only in my undershorts! <laughs> it was only in my undershorts! That's what he said! It was, but it was only in my undershorts! <laughs> Dude, and I remember there was this kid who he was like in third grade and he couldn't really go to the bathroom so he wore so he wore a diaper and the teachers always check on him like when I was in third grade and I just heard and I just overheard like a conversation with them and I heard the teacher say to the kid in the bathroom are you clean? And from that day forward, I have never underestimated the fact that you can have some incontinent kids in your classroom. What? I said, I didn't pay attention at all. I have no idea what you just said. Well, that's great. Well, thank you guys for watching the podcast. That was like the lamest podcast ever. But I hope you enjoyed it. It was just in my undershirt.